Hey guys, I'm going to show you the quick and easy way to upload 1080p videos to YouTube using Premiere Pro. So first off, you want your video clip into the timeline. Make sure that your sequence markers are set to the end of the film. So next, go to File, Export, Adobe Media Encoder. So for format, you want to click H.264. Make sure you're exporting audio. If you're in different regions, depending on where you are, you're going to want to choose NTSC or PEL. Since I'm in North America, I'm going to be choosing NTSC. Now the next set of numbers depends on your camera. If you're using a Canon HD DSLR camera, you can follow these numbers exactly. But if you're not using one, you might want to check with your camera settings or guess and check with the source and output to make sure that your frames are fully showing. So the numbers that I use are 1920 by 1080. For frame rate, if you're using 24 frames per second, use a 23.976 rather than the 24. Pixel aspect ratio, I use square pixels, profile baseline, level 5.1, which is the highest to allow for the most bitrate settings that I can use. So bitrate encoding, some people use CBR, some people use VBR 1-pass for fast, video, fast rendering. I use VBR 2-pass because it takes longer, but you do get higher quality. Some people used to like to use target bitrate as 5 megabits per second, or up to 7.5. I like to use 8.5. Maximum bitrate, some people use between 10 to 12. I go up a notch to 16. This is all personal preference, but these are just the numbers that I use. For audio, you're going to want to choose AAC plus version 1. Output stereo, 48 kilohertz, audio quality high, bitrate 48. Multiplexer is important because you want to kind of choose MP4 and stream compatibility is standard so that you can output to YouTube. So what you can do next is save your preset such as 1080p YouTube so that way you can find the setting easily when you export your next video. So just click OK, name it, and then save it. So I hope you guys found this video useful in comparison to other longer tutorials out on YouTube. If you have any suggestions, should I talk faster, slower, add captions, add some more details, did I say something wrong? Just put it in the comments section down below. Otherwise, like and favorite it so that you can save it for later. And hope that this helps you guys export more videos to YouTube.